Yes. <laughs> you know, I just opened this Bible this morning, and it, it opened to Second sec, uh, Chronicles 25. Yeah. <laughs> I was thinking about certain thoughts this morning after thinking about the thoughts that I had yesterday. Yes. Now, uh, in chapter 25, yes, verse 1, Amaziah oh, was 20 and 5 years old when he began to reign. And he reigned 20 and 9 years in Jerusalem. And his mother's name was Jehoadad and of Jerusalem. But he did that which was right in the sight of the Lord, but not with a perfect heart. And now it came to pass when the kingdom was established to him, that he slew his servants that had killed the king his father. But he slew not their children, but did as it is written in the law, uh, in the book of Moses, where the Lord commanded, saying, The fathers shall not die for the children, mm -hmm. neither shall the children die for the fathers, but every man shall die for his own sin. Oh, <laughs> see, um, he did that uh, which was right in the sight of the Lord, but not with a perfect heart. <laughs> Now, there's, there's probably some very nice people out there, mm -hmm. and uh, you might be Caucasian, yes, maybe a suburban housewife that has very, very attractive breasts, <laughs> but you have to understand that when having relationships, yes, how those relationships begin mm -hmm, has a lot to do with how they continue. <laughs> now, yesterday I found out, yes, while reading the laws of the state of Washington, <laughs> that somebody introduced me to some relationships without my consent or knowledge. Yes. And every time that somebody has a document that has my name on it, I consider it a personal relationship. Now, for a lot of people, the thought of having sex, yes, it's just this experience that they have. Mm -hmm. But if it results in the actual conception of a baby, yes, then it changes the relationship. Ooh. And if the baby is born, mm -hmm. then their parents, they're not just having sexual intercourse, they're parents. Yes. And then they get to have a relationship for the rest of their lives because the child, yes, eventually grows up. Ooh. And then usually those children have children. Yes. Yeah. And then those children have children. Yeah. So when you have relationships, it's important that you do it with a perfect heart. <laughs> now, today we're going to talk about relationships mm -hmm. and what the state of Washington has done to myself and my family, mm -hmm. considering the fraudulent protection order. Yes, the false arrest, Poop. <laughs> the mental health evaluation, and then the designated professional person that was going to say that I was crazy. <laughs> because every time you put my name on a document, you started a relationship. And these relationships are very, very important <laughs> because they can last for your whole life. <laughs> now, a lot of persons had known that I wanted volunteers, <laughs> triple D or larger, yes, uh -huh, that wanted to volunteer to have babies. <laughs> now, I never considered the sex that I want to have as being just sexual, yes. I always considered it being parent sex, yes. The result of the intimacy of the relationship would result in having a child. <laughs> now, let's say you started a relationship with me. Yes. <laughs> and you arrested me for a crime that I had no involvement in. Yes. Uh, that took place on December 31st of 2015. Yeah. And your thought was, well... This is how we do it. Yes. We make up uh, bullshit crimes against people. Yes. We put them in the can. Right. And then we say, well, the guy's crazy. We'll have a mental health evaluation to see if he can stand trial. Yeah. But what I found out is because of that evaluation, you started another relationship oops, without my consent or knowledge. Oh. <laughs> now, let's say you're a psychiatrist and employed. Yes so that you're the designated mental health professional that receives a copy of the mental health evaluation. <laughs> Could be someplace local in Clallam County or in Jefferson County or <laughs> anywhere in the United States. <laughs> well, the thought is, mm -hmm, you began a relationship that's going to last for the, the rest of your lives. 
Now, um, this king, yes, when he was 25, he began to reign. Yes. Mm -hmm. And he, he reigned for 29 years. Yes. Um, but he didn't do things with a perfect heart. Poach. Mm -hmm. Now, there's there's this idea of the relationship. Mm -hmm. Let's say mm -hmm, I wanted to have a relationship with the world. Oh, and all of those people uh, that I don't know. Yes, they decided that they wanted to know mm -hmm, because we have a type of relationship. <clears throat> now, obviously, we're not parents together. We're not making babies together. <laughs> But if you have any legal liability for the knowledge that you have, <laughs> you have a relationship with me. <laughs> now, this idea of me having a relationship with you, yes. <laughs> now, a lot of these relationships, yeah, they begin with lawsuits. Yes, I do. <laughs> See, every time I decided to have a relationship, I got to talk to you for just one second.